Hello, I'm meteorologist Kathy Saban. I hope you're enjoying your day. A beautiful day as high pressure sets up over Colorado and points westward. The weather that will affect travel today is all across the eastern seaboard. Our storm is marching toward the east. Two lines of showers, Memphis, St. Louis, Chicago, the other through the Carolinas into Boston and New York. There may be some severe thunderstorms, storms with hail that will impact travel. This whole system is headed for Washington, and uh, I do think there will be some airport delays across the northeast today while Colorado, California, the desert southwest, mild and dry for the first full day of fall. Autumnal equinox today at 1.20 p.m. Very little in the way of cloud cover, let alone moisture for any type of thunder showers or rain shower activity. Another cool start. Yesterday, DIA's morning low was in the upper 30s. This morning, low 40s. So a slow warming trend will be 75 by 1 o'clock and 80 degrees by about 5 o'clock today. Generally, highs this time of year in the upper 70s. We'll see that average at Colorado Springs, but Denver, Greeley, Fort Collins, a few degrees warmer. Aspen Vale, Breck up to Steamboat, down to Crested Butte in the 60s today, and a beautiful day along the Front Range foothills. Again, with less smoke and haze. We'll take that. Sunny at 80, autumnal equinox at 120 today. Tonight, first evening of fall, fair skies in 49. We do see a warming trend for both Thursday and Friday for the most part. Numbers come down a little bit with a little wind shift, but back into a warming trend for the first full weekend of fall. And did you see that full moon a couple nights ago? That full harvest moon. Keep sending those pictures in. I'm really loving those. Have a great day. Thanks for watching.